Did you know that Freon is being phased out by the year 2020 due to government regulations? And did you know that this phase out is leading to costly AC unit repairs and replacements since all units will soon need to run on the new refrigerant called Puron? Not clear on what any of this means? No problem. We're here to help. First, let's talk about Freon, also known as R22. Many home air conditioning units, also called HVAC units, that were built before 2010 run on a refrigerant called Freon. The federal government wants to discontinue use of Freon because of its ozone-depleting properties. In order to get rid of it for good, the government has mandated that Freon production be reduced over time until year 2020, when it will no longer be available. With this, Freon AC units are no longer being manufactured. So replacement parts are becoming less available and more costly. What's worse, given that many homeowners are still using AC units that require Freon and supply for the refrigerant is shrinking, the price for the refrigerant is quickly on the rise. This means a simple part replacement can be a costly repair. Why? Because AC units lose refrigerant when a part fails. So it can cost hundreds, even thousands of dollars just to refill the unit with Freon. What's taking place of Freon? Going forward, all new air conditioners will use a refrigerant called Puron, also known as R410A, which is deemed safer for the environment and more energy efficient. However, the problem is that you cannot add Puron refrigerant to an air conditioner that's designed to run on Freon. They simply are not compatible. An analogy would be like trying to use unleaded gasoline in a diesel engine. Of course, the next question is, can I just modify my existing air conditioner to make it compatible with Puron? The simple answer is that it depends on the type of air conditioner. Sometimes split systems can be modified, whereas packaged AC systems must be completely replaced. Let's take a look at the two different systems. A split air conditioning system has two major components that are located in two different parts of the home. The first component is a large metal box, called a condenser, that is located on the outside of the home on the ground. The second component is referred to as the air handler. The air handler is located inside the home, either in the attic, garage, or closet. Let's say a common part in the condenser, like the coil, fails and needs to be replaced. This item may not be available for Freon units, so the entire condenser has to be replaced with a Puron one. This presents a problem. Now the other half of the air conditioning system, the air handler, will need to be replaced with matching Puron components to be compatible. Another common failure is the compressor, which is located inside of the condenser. These are typically available for Freon units. However, with the ever-rising cost of Freon, this repair could become very costly since the whole system will need to be refilled with refrigerant. In this scenario, the homeowner may choose to replace the entire unit to a new Puron one to avoid the high cost of Freon refrigerant. Now, let's take a look at a packaged air conditioning unit. A packaged unit is most commonly located on the roof of a home. It's called a packaged unit because all of the main mechanical parts are housed together in one casing. There are specific parts in a package unit that can fail and may be deemed unrepairable. This could either be due to the expense of the repair exceeding the cost of a new unit or the part no longer being available. In either case, the entire system would need to be replaced with a new Puron system. As you can see, the Freon phase-out impacts homeowners in a significant way. At some point, any homeowner with a Freon system will need to make a sizable investment to make the switch to Puron. Please help us spread the word about the Freon phase-out by sharing this information with your friends and family. If you'd like to learn more, please visit our Freon forum on our website at oneguardhw.com Freon or give us a call at 888-896-0014 and we'll be happy to assist you.